management of any ecosystem is greatly enhanced if we can measure some parts of that ecosystem. But you have to choose which part to measure. In a forest ecosystem, the trees dominate much of the ecosystem, so it sounds appropriate that you want to measure them. The above ground material can be seen, but you can also see dead material and leaf litter, which is a direct um, relationship to the amount of uh, tree material above the ground. So what's a nice fast way of measuring this material above the ground to help us uh, quantify this ecosystem? We want something we can take lots of measurements of and do it fairly quickly and cheaply. One of the greatest tools we have in forestry is the Spiegel Relescope. It's an incredibly powerful tool which allows us to do an awful lot of measurements quite simply. The measurements themselves are called point samples where you take a single point on the ground and all your measurements are based on that point. So literally just uh, looking through the instrument and comparing the size of the trees with uh, what you can see through the viewfinder you can estimate the above ground quantity of, of tree material from just doing a quick sweep which is basically looking through the viewfinder of the relicoscope and uh, moving around in a circle. However, you do have to be able to see all the trees so if there's a tree close to you that's blocking your view of the trees behind it you might have to step off your point to look at the trees behind but once you finish that you step back on your point and uh, continue your sweep. It's good practice to start say always at the north side so you know when you finish the sweep and don't keep going round and round in circles and counting the same three, tree three or four times. So what do you see when you look through the telescope? You're looking through the viewfinder and you can see scales but you can also see the trees themselves. So through the viewfinder it is uh, um, confusing to start with, there's lots of scales. On the left hand side there is uh, fairly fine scales with lots of numbers. Then there's a big band called band 1. There's a little black and white band, another black and white band. And then there's uh, two centre bands with more numbers. And then band 2. And in the far right there's uh, another set of black and white stripes. For measuring stand basal area, which is a particularly powerful tool, we can use band 1. And what you do with band 1 is you line up the left hand side of band 1 with the left hand side of the tree and to see if, if the right hand side of the tree falls within the coloured band 1. If it's less than band 1 thickness, it's an out tree, it's too small or too far away and we don't have to count it. If it's bigger than that, as in this tree, you count it. That's all there is to it. That tree appears bigger than band 1, so we count it. If the trees are bent and curved, you bend the relescope to see uh, as they're curved. If you're looking down a great deal, we uh, look down with the relescope and it corrects for the distance that you're, in fact, you're looking further than, than otherwise. So it's fairly quick to count trees as in or out by doing this technique. And every in tree con contributes what they call one square metre of basal area to the forest. So there's your complete sweep. We can now work out quickly how much basal area this forest has and basal area is highly correlated with a whole range of other things that are of interest in a forest ecosystem. So from basal area we can estimate volume of the forest, we can estimate the growing capacity of the crown and if you've calibrated your uh, models you can start to also estimate uh, material on the ground, dead woody debris, grass litter, layer etc. And it's easy to quickly measure a whole range of sites and compare and contrast them simply by doing these basal area sweeps. So this second site you can quickly see. As you spin around you could uh, not only count the trees but you could also classify them for their species or their health or other factors.